This presentation is brought to you by Terry Fraser's RV Center in Eldridge, Iowa. Terry Fraser's RV Center, where there's no extra freight charge, no extra prep fee, no battery fee, no hidden finance fee, finance here or not, same low price. At Terry Fraser's, you get a lifetime of experience. This is a 2019 Avalanche fifth wheel, model number 395BH by Keystone RV, and this presentation is brought to you by Terry Fraser's RV Center in Eldridge, Iowa. Okay, let's start with the high gloss gel coated embedded aerodynamic front cap. We do have the embedded LED lights in there, docking assistance mirror. This is their Rotoflex pin box by Trail Air on the unit. Plenty of storage provided in the front pod there above the landing gear. This is a four slide out floor plan on this unit. Coming around towards the back side here, you do have automated one touch electronic leveling provided right there. Twin 30 pound LP tanks inside the cover right there. This next one will be a full pass through. We're gonna talk about that here in just a little bit here. Here's unified connection docking center where you have your exterior shower as well as your full satellite connections, coax inputs there. You do have city water connection, fresh water, valve work in there as well as tank fill connections, valves for dump as well for that gray tank there and low point drains as well all in one convenient heated area there. 12 gallon gas electric water heater provided through there coming around past the back side here we have a vent which is going to indicate that you do have a fully ducted exterior vented range hood we're going to discover that here in just a little bit coming down underneath here 16 inch tandems there we've got our g-rated tires these are nitrogen filled radials coming along past the rear slide out portion six point leveling again on that with the electronic leveling Coming around towards the back side here, we have 50 amp electrical service, the detachable shore power cord, twist lock provided right through there. Let's take a look and we'll stand back here just a little bit and see what this looks like from this direction here. We obviously have a rear entry through there. We're gonna talk about that in just a little bit. We do have roof access with full walk on roof with the ladder there. Here we are prepped for the easy addition of a rear vision camera of your choice. That's an option that may be selected if you wish. Coming around over here towards the camping site, you're going to notice that we do have full radius cut tinted safety glass windows. Those are frameless windows. How cool is that? Okay, here we have the exterior kitchen option. This includes a 38 inch TV with exterior speakers there. Full sink provided as well as your refrigerator there. This would be a two cubic foot refrigerator. And down below we do have your radio options right there for the external stereo. All right, we have two awnings on this unit. First of which would be the one towards the back here. It's 11 foot on that one. The forward awning would be 14 feet. These are power activated awnings with the LED embedded strip lighting included on there. Again, you can take a look at these large panoramic sized frameless windows. Way cool. Coming along over towards the entryway here. This is the solid step staircase. Very easy to deploy that there. Four steps straight up and on in you go. D-assist entry handle provided through there. Now Avalanche comes with the Keystone's three year structural warranty on the unit. That gives you extra peace of mind. Speaking of peace of mind, down underneath there you are rated for negative four degrees. Full time camping construction there with the uh, thermofoil insulation and thermoshield holding tank insulation as well. Now, slam latch doors here. We're gonna open this one up with the, with the magnetic grab. Wah, there you go. All right, full pass-through storage, generous pass-through storage as you can tell right through there. Looking at it through this way and over to here. All right, we have hydraulic controls inside that pod right there. You are prepped for the easy addition of a solar kit should you so wish. It connects in right there with an external AC outlet provided on there. Okay, let's go on to the interior here through 28 inch doorway with another reminder that this presentation is brought to you by Terry Fraser's RV Center in Eldridge, Iowa. Terry Fraser's where the battery and the box are included with the sale. It's not just some sort of an option or extra. No, it's included with the sale. So you're gonna need it, you're gonna get it. Now likewise, there is no shipping fee at Terry Fraser's and likewise, no silly prep fee that's just a ripoff that's a scam we don't do that here and perhaps most pleasantly you can bring your own financing or finance through us you get the same great price either which way no mind games on financing okay as we're panning around here looking around you've noticed this is the forest floor interior decor other decor options may be available simply inquire hey let's move on towards the back here and start out working our way from the back towards the front here. Let's start out in everybody's favorite room. 
the Biffy. All right, now this is the rear Biffy, one of two. You've got the China porcelain stool right there. Full shower surround, it goes up all the way to the skylight up above. You sliding glass doors on that shower. This is the kid's shower, you might consider it, or kid's bathroom with a vanity right through there. GFCI protected electrical outlets there, pull down pleated shades. Now this is really neat because you have the entryway from the back right there. You don't have to track all sorts of mud, dirt, and debris. If the kids are outside playing and they just need to come in and use the lavatory, well there you go. They're not tracking dirt in and to the main part of the coach. Okay, let's move on over to here. Now this is the kids den here. We have the soft touch sleeper sofa right through there with an egress window in behind it there. Full function with the pull down shades. Very tall slide out there. Oh, not that kids usually get that tall, but Anyway, second air conditioning unit. This one's a 13,500 BTU, fully ducted air conditioning unit over here. This again in the in the uh, bunkhouse area. You do have prep area right there for the easy addition of the bunkhouse television. You have your coax and your AC connections right there. Hey, let's pull out the ladder here, deploy that, and take a quick look on the loft up above. Take a quick step up and look around. You've got one bunk right on over here, and the second one right around over to here. Now you also have the prep for the easy addition of another television set should you wish. You also have USB outlets provided right through there. Pull down shades there at nighttime. Makes it very comfortable for the kids and very easy to get at with the ladder. How cool is that? Okay, that's enough of the bunkhouse. Let's move on to the main portion of the coach over here. We'll work our way around. Let's start right over here with this huge sofa. And I do have the table set up in there, the dining table for Convenience, easily removable. You slide it right up and off and you don't have to have it there. Sleeper sofa makes for additional sleeping capacity. Now this slide out, extra tall, tall slide out. You're not gonna be hitting your head on the top of the sofa or on the top of the uh, uh, fascia on that there. Here we have theater seats, two of them. And this is complete with recliner function on that there. How cool is that? All right, look at the view through this slide out here. Plenty of windows and these are full function windows on the sides of the slide out as well. All right, here we've got a little area where you can hang up extra garments if you wish. Coming around over towards here, we've got a 50 inch TV. That's a flat screen LED, HD TV. Entertainment center below with AM, FM, CD, DVD, USB, Bluetooth, blah, all sorts of stuff down there. And below a designer, 40 inch fireplace there. Not only does it look great, it provides a lot of additional heat. Okay, moving along over to here, you have a convection 30 inch residential style stainless steel front microwave oven. And down below we have a three burner range top that is with the fold away cover. We'll pull the cover back here so you can see how that works. There you go with lit control knobs as well. And the oven below which does also have an oven light too. We'll point that out. And down below some additional storage too. Moving along over to here, your refrigerator and freezer functions. Norcold, gas and electric. Refrigerator and freezer, that's of course with the stainless steel fronts as you can tell right there, travel locks. Let's open it up here and take a look at what this looks like from here. The freezer up above, there we go. And that is an 18 cubic foot refrigerator there, complete with crisper doors down below and the freezer up above. Way cool, that's why Norcold again, gas and electric keeps it cold on the ride to where you're going. All right, here we've got, we'll open the door up and watch what happens. The light comes on, why? That's motion activated, very cool there, very elegant as well. This is your pantry storage, obviously. Coming around over to here, you do have solid surface countertops throughout with plenty of storage up and down, as well as up above through there. Let's talk a little bit about the island here. We just went right by it here. Again, solid surface countertops. Let's remove the sink covers here. It's going to reveal that you've got a twin bowl recess mounted stainless steel sink here. And the high rise faucet with the spray attachment nozzle action. Way cool. All right, let's put her back together here and work our way over towards the upper part of the unit. Coming around again past the 28 inch doorway here. Well apportioned and coming over to here, you do have your systems control monitor panel area right here. You have your monitor controls up above as well as lighting uh, controls for the electric awnings, plural. Remember you got two of them there. Okay, and the slide out controls as well uh, as some of your other controls all in one neat little area like that. Okay, now on into everyone's favorite room, the Biffy. 
Again, China porcelain stool here, foot flush, it's a marine grade stool. Coming around over towards this side, GFCI protected electrical outlet. This is your lavatory with a medicine cabinet up above. And here you've got your power vent. You're gonna want the vent. And of course you can see you've got the sliding glass doors here provided on the full surround bathtub shower area all the way up to the skylight overhead. All right, let's move on. You do have access to the bedroom from the sliding door here. Wah, there we go. Queen bed and very spacious. We'll step back here and take a look at that. All right, here you've got your additional air conditioning unit provided here. This one's 15,000 BTU, or excuse me, this one's 13,500 BTUs. The other one was 15,000, I had them backwards. No big deal there. All right, King omnidirectional antenna system provided for the TV use. All right, you do have USB outlets provided right through there and full function windows on the sides of this slide out. That means they do open, they have a screen on them, they have pull down shades, the whole nine yards. You can create quite a nice breeze in here should you wish to open those up. Okay, coming around back over towards this way, let's look at some of the accommodations this direction. You are pre-prepped, you're prepped and ready to go here for the easy addition of a bedroom television set of your choice. I pulled down the shades there for the pleated shades, lambrequin covers right over it. Hey, let's talk about closeting here. Slide open the glass paneled door there. You've got plenty of generous closeting here. The closet bar provided through there. Open these up, you've got additional closet options. Whoa, what do we have here? You are washer and dryer prepped for the easy addition of a washer and dryer of your choice because the plumbing, electrical, everything is ready to go for that. Way cool. Okay, I think we fairly well finished up everything here in the bedroom. Let's step back out into the main portion of the coach. Now you do have a 35,000 BTU fully ducted furnace throughout here. And again, a reminder that you did have the 15,000 BTU main air conditioning unit. We saw that in the cubby space over there. Otherwise, I believe we've covered everything. Oh, no, we did miss the fantastic fan on the ceiling. Oh, there we go. Fantastic fan, whole coach fan creates quite a breeze throughout here, as well as the paddle fan over there behind it. All right, now we've covered everything inside this 2019 Avalanche fifth wheel model number 395BH by Keystone RV with a final reminder that this presentation has been brought to you by Terry Fraser's RV Center in Eldridge, Iowa. Thank you.